Hello, I'm Steve. This is Bit of Munch. And this time I have got Mayflower Beef and Broccoli Noodles. Also, the last few of these Iceland Duck Spring Rolls, which I've had loads of times and they're really, really good. And here's what it all looks like. Now I was going to put this in a bowl because I thought it would have more of a sauce with it. But it hasn't, so it's gone on a plate, which means you can see it better. It's very colourful, isn't it? Very colourful. And the main smell coming off this, surprisingly, is the bamboo shoots. Really, I mean, I like bamboo shoots, don't get me wrong, but that is the overriding smell I'm getting. Strange. Another thing that's strange, or not what I expected, because um, this says <clears throat> this says beef and broccoli, I thought it would be proper pieces of beef, but it's not. It's minced beef. Okay, this was. I've already told you the price. I don't know. It was one seventy five from Poundland. Uh, it doesn't actually give you a product description on this. I don't think. No, beef beef and broccoli noodles. Cooking instructions, ingredients. I cooked it in the microwave, by the way. It takes eight minutes. There's the uh, ingredients, if that will actually focus. Uh, Fifteen percent minced beef. I've already checked that. Twenty-nine percent noodles. Loads of stuff in this. I say carrots, peas, bamboo shoots, red peppers. Uh, sauce. It just says okay. There's not much of that. Right, let's just dive into it. Loads of E numbers as well. E621, E26, oh, loads of them. Right, let's just have a go. Now, I will say I'm not the biggest fan of broccoli. So I'm going to try a bit of that first. Oh, I think I have a pea there as well. Oh, but, oh well. Any more broccoli? That's just a stalk. Oh, a bit, a bit of carrot as well. There we go. It's very soft, very soft. Now I've had quite a lot of um, Mayflower products in the past and most of them have been really, really good. So far this isn't particularly impressing me, it hasn't got a lot of taste. This is very disappointing, it really is. I mean, noodles themselves are a really good consistency, they're just right. Um, I said the overall smell was bamboo shoots. That isn't the overall taste. It hasn't really got much of an overall taste of anything, to be honest. Taste that bamboo shoot though. Try a couple of peas on their own. Oh, that tastes nice. But, yeah, this isn't the best Mayflower meal I've had, far from it. Everything is good consistency, it's just right. Um, but it's under seasoned, under flavoured, and I'm under impressed. Hmm. That's really, really disappointing. Very disappointing. So, I've got to go in with the soy sauce, haven't I? I've just got to. <clears throat> Before I do that, though, let's have a bite of one of these uh, spring rolls. I know these are really good, so I've had them loads of times. Mm. 
Mmm. <clears throat> now that's got taste. That really has. <laughs> really nice. Right. Let's try and get some life into this thing. Okay. Soy sauce. Which is now going to run everywhere, isn't it? I should have transferred this to a bowl before I put the soy sauce on. Never mind. Mmm. Oh, there's a huge lump of meat there. Look at that. That is what it needed. It needed soy sauce. Let's see what the huge lump of meat is like. Mmm. Yeah. Huh. That was really good. Really tasted beefy. Perhaps they should have put more big lumps of meat in it. Mm. Overall though, I am not impressed. As I said, I've tried several Mayflower products. Most have been really, really good. This one just isn't. It really isn't. I mean, the quality of the ingredients is, is okay. The texture's okay. There's just not much taste. The soy sauce has improved it <clears throat> vastly, but I wouldn't have that again. I really wouldn't. Check out my other Mayflower reviews. If you haven't uh, tried any Mayflower products, check out those reviews and you'll see how good they are normally. But yeah, wouldn't have that again. Okay, I'm going to eat the rest of that with uh, probably some more of that and possibly a bit of salt as well. I don't know if that, even that, even that, I don't know if that would help. Right, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.